Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I'll be reacting right to episode 42 of Star Twinkle Pretty Here. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. No! So, she'll be able to be here with you guys. What's important to you? Elena. You're struggling with that problem too, aren't you? You don't want to do anything else? Yeah, but the way you say that, something about that's not right. So, I mean, because I think this is the Lena episode where she's like, what, finally going to get her uh, twinkle imagination? I'm guessing. Uh, as Monica did say, she does have everything figured out. And, you know, sometimes that's fine. But the way she said, yeah... I don't know. Something about that didn't feel good to me. Okay, so the funny thing about this, I downloaded this because it's not like 7 o'clock and I just finished just the order of rabbit. I want to say around 2, 3 o'clock in the afternoon I downloaded, but then I went to sleep. I took like a 3, 4, 5 hour nap because um, I was sleepy and I was downloading some other things and I was just like, okay, I'm just going to let it go and then I'll wake up and stuff. Um... I downloaded this, and I typically go into Handbrake. I have to make it into a file so that I can watch it, and then um, immediately do whatever I have to do. And so typically, I have to put in the subtitles and stuff. So the weirdest thing was, there was no subtitles for when I was trying to download this, and I never decided to click on the video by itself after it was done. Before I watched it, The Order of Rabbit, I clicked on it, and the subtitles were already in there. And I was like, I could have had this done several hours ago, but I went to sleep. So now it's 7 o'clock and I'm trying to hurry up and get this out because it's the only thing that's coming out today. Because I have no idea where I cut to when parade is. And I hope I cut to when parade comes out tomorrow, at least. Mm. Is she making soup? Cookies. <laughs> 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 Mm. Oh. oh no, honey. Oh. Bye, Elena. Bye, baby. You're from my hero. You're so good, baby.
Mm -mm. But you can see that look on your face, honey. Of course it was. <laughs> you better save some for you. Yeah. She'll be fine. It'll be okay. You could be a teenager. <laughs> Seriously? Oh my god. In the, seriously. I'll just have all three. Duh. I want donuts. But I think Dunkin' Donuts is closed now, so. It's gonna say no. Mm -hmm. Elena. So count on her when you're in a bind, honey. Literally came around full circle. Thanks. Mm -hmm. The, you know, not the mom and dad. Well, no, yeah, they are the mom and dad of this series. So, I mean, I'm just saying.
Mm -hmm. I sure did. <laughs> and that happens to everybody. Yes. Lala's brother. Her hot good looking brother. I mean in a way, it, it's like she kinda wants to do something like her mom. She likes making people happy. So See, you know what I thought they were going to do? They were still going to transform. Elena wasn't going to be in it. Elena was going to have like a little like moment for like a couple of minutes and then somebody would have snapped her out of it instead of like, okay, let's immediately just go ahead and snap her the heck out of it. I think it would have been a little bit better for her character and then kind of getting into a little bit of despair. You know how like kind of they did with Go Princess in a way because there were a couple episodes that they did her with it. But I mean, it's okay. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> you know, one thing that I'm kind of hoping with feeling good is we get the ink transformations again. I mean, it made it unique, but I want them to kind of carry it on to the next series. But how much you want to bet they're not going to do that? <laughs> Because, I mean, you had one of my other favorite voice actresses in this show. Two different, from two different series. So how in the world are you going to trump that with this next cast? I mean, I, I was wondering that after when I found out freaking Sarami was freaking Cure Felice. And I was like, there's no way in heck you can trump her. And then you kind of did it with Kitty 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 Girl of Mode. Not really as Hakuto, but then you also did it with this show. But you got, you know, freaking Anna, Anastasia from Cinderella Girls. How can you trump her for this next show? <laughs> Whoever they get to voice these next cures, uh, it's going to be a little harder for them to kind of impress me. Because the funny thing is, I think three girls out of this show are all in several different shows that I've seen in this past year. I mean, especially for, like, Lala, because Lala was one of the big ones, especially because she was in, like, a lot of ish that I watched this year. <laughs> the same thing for Elena, because she's, her voice actress is in My Hero, and she's doing amazing on that show. Don't worry. I mean, we got time. She's going to understand it in like five minutes. But you also need to believe in yourself.
of course not, but you'll be back. And you'll deal with it again. But that's why. See, I feel like this was part two. Yeah, this is part two for Elena. So, I don't know if next week is going to be, like, her end story for her and finally figure out what she wants to do. Because, you see, she there was no resolve for it. She still has something, but there's still a lot of things that are left unanswered questions that we really don't have about her and essentially what she wants to do in her life. So, hopefully 43 has something on her because i would really hate if this show ended and you didn't explain anything else on her i'm just still gonna put up that fake smile and you gotta feel bad for her that's why ariana grande wrote that song fake smile and ariana grande is also in my town and i didn't have money to go see her in concert but you know it's okay i'll go i'll try again next time She's gonna come back to Jacksonville one day. Don't know when. But this is a good episode. I, I just hate, I feel like this was part two out of three. It, it seems like a three-parter for Elena. So I'm guessing the next episode has to be on her. I would hate for them to go like, oh, hey, this week's Elena. Next week, we're going to somebody else. And then finally, we're gonna go back to Elena and we're gonna finish her thing. I've seen a lot of shows do that in the past and sometimes I have like a love-hate relationship on it and how they kind of really progress the show with it because some shows will go hear somebody else and then they'll go back to that person again and they'll say like previously on such and such and it's like well if you did this the following week after that episode had come out you wouldn't have to say previously on such and such whatever the name of the anime is but it's so good. I just hope that they're able to complete her character really well. I Like I said, I don't want this show to end how many of her episodes it's going to end, whether it's 49 or 50 episodes, and make me like dislike one thing from Elena's storyline. Just give her the ending that she needs. And you're doing it. <laughs> But you can say, oh. No, there is, it is about Alina still. Oh. And she's going to get a twinkle. That's why. That's why you didn't want her to get a twinkle imagination this week. Because she's like, mm, she has this darkness inside of her this week. And she has to be depressed between the, uh, the whole episode of this one, of 42, going into 43, until she essentially is able to find herself and okay i love the fact that they're doing that thank god it wasn't like yeah let's focus on somebody else for a second and then let's go with elena but no they're finishing it i mean because last week's episode was monica and the one before was elena and it's i mean it would have been better if they would have just did it bam 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 instead of bam monica bam bam elena done but i get that sometimes you have to have it in like not be ha, not have it be like episode after episode after episode with a certain character sometimes you have to say here's part one of a three-parter episode with that person focus on somebody else then do part two into uh, part three but i mean i think with this last one it is going to tie her character all together specifically what she wants to do in her life how she wants to go about it and then instead of having this fake smile and always being like so many things are on her mind, and the only way that she can get through it is just having this make ugh, fake smile, and you know, having her mom plus her family and her friends all look at her like, you know, I love her smile, but you can genuinely see that that looks fake to me. She's not one hundred percent being truthful to herself, and so it's going to be a really big turnaround next Sunday when this comes out. So I hope and pray that this is going to be the best episode for her because. The la this episode and the following week episodes, they were both good for her. But I think this very, this part three of this three-parter series for Elena, this is going to be her, like, the one that is probably going to be known for. Maybe, I'm not 100% sure, it could be a lot of people's favorite episode for her. Maybe, because I think, like, for me, mine was 
the one I think the first episode she came in and then the episode with her uh her younger brother and saying that her parents were embarrassing I thought that was like the cutest episode because you can relate to that because yeah we all have embarrassing parents I still have embarrassing parents but hey we all get that but I ain't gonna know until next I'm about to say next Friday. Next Sunday. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to you towards episode 42 of Star Trickle Pretty Here. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day for the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys maybe next Sunday, maybe on Monday, depending on uh, what time this episode comes out next, uh, uh, next Saturday. Next Sunday, once again, because since freaking GoGo -Go Anime Hub was has been like an episode behind the only way that i've been able to get this is through kiss and yan and thank god yan had the episode because otherwise i would have had to wait until tomorrow just to see this but until then i will see you guys all next time bye <laughs>